going on everyone this is the mac roberts back again with another nba 2k21 my player builder video and today we're going to be taking a look at the best derrick rose build now i already did d rose on last gen or ps4 xbox one so if you're looking for that video check it out in the title card above so without further ado let's get into the build position is going to be point guard hand in this doesn't matter jersey number also doesn't matter i just chose one because that's the number that he wore when he was the mvp of the league for the body settings, we're going to bring him down to 6'2". For the weight, you're going to bring him down to 194 pounds. And for the wingspan, you're going to bring it up to 6'8". That is his actual height, not quite his actual weight. The reason why we're bringing him down to 194 is because we wanted to get that 95 speed with ball, but that is his actual wingspan. And body shape doesn't really matter. I'm just going to go with the find. Now for the attributes, you're going to bring your close shot up to an 81. Your driving layup up to a 92. Your driving dunk up to a 90. And that's going to give you 15 finishing badges. For shooting, you're going to bring your mid range shot up to an 86. Your three point shot up to a 71. And your free throw up to a 77. And that's going to give you nine shooting badges. For playmaking, you're going to bring your pass accuracy up to an 84. Your ball handling up to a 91. And your speed with ball up to a 95 and max it out. And that's going to give you 25 playmaking badges. Lastly, for defense and rebounding, you're going to bring your perimeter defense up to a 73. And your steal up to a 66. And that's going to give you one defense and rebounding badge. So 15 finishing, 9 shooting. 25 playmaking and one defense and rebounding badge is a total of 50 badges. For your physicals, you're going to bring your speed up to an 86, your acceleration up to an 86. Alternatively, you can bring it down to 84 and 88. I do kind of like this a little bit better. For your strength, you're going to bring it up to a 52. And your vertical, you're going to bring it up to an 81. And you're going to spend the rest on stamina. So at 99 overall, you have a close shot of 85, a 96 driving lip, and a 94 driving dunk. For your shooting stats, you have a 90 mid-range shot, a 75 three-point shot, and an 81 free throw. For your playmaking, you have an 88 pass accuracy, a 95 ball handle, and a 99 speed with ball. And for your defense and rebounding, you'll have a 77 perimeter defense and a 70 steal. For your physicals, at 99 overall, you'll have a 92 speed, a 96 acceleration, a 60 strength, an 89 vertical, and a 90 stamina. For your takeover, I would go with easy blow buys and finishing moves as the two takeovers. And the build is complete and you have built a slashing playmaker, shades of Mahmoud Abdul-Aruf, John Morant, and Damian Lillard. Now for your badges, for your finishing badges, you're going to put Acrobat on gold, Fearless Finisher on gold, Posterizer on gold, Slither Finisher on gold, and Giant Slayer on gold. For your shooting badges, you're going to put Difficult Shots on gold, Clutch Shooter on silver, Volume Shooter on gold, and Catch and Shoot on bronze. For your playmaking badges, you're going to put Ankle Breaker on gold, Bullet Pass on silver, Dimer on bronze, downhill on Hall of Fame, floor general on bronze, handles for days on silver, quick first step on Hall of Fame, tight handles on gold, stop and go on gold, and space crater on silver. And for your one defense and rebounding badge, you're gonna put it on pick dodger. All right, everyone, this has been the best Derrick Rose build. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon and join the Penny Face Squad. That'd be greatly appreciated. It helps out the channel overall. And you'll also be kept up with everything we do in the channel. So you don't want to miss any of that. Drop a comment below and let me know what you thought of the build. I'm taking requests. So if you have a build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below. And I'll try to make that build for you. I'm making builds every single day for next gen. Uh, I'm not doing current gen so much anymore, but I'll do it for a quest. So if you have a current gen build that you want to see me make, let me know in the comment section below as well. Just say, hey, I want this build for current gen, and I'll try to make that build up for you. Last but not least, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.